Use your arrows to browse New York, NY, May 29th, Jose L. Tuvi. Photo by El Bello, Getty Images The 2018 season has instilled a solid amount of doubt in the rebuild and quite a few White Sox fans. This draft should have erased most if not all of that doubt. Rick Hahn in the front office absolutely nailed their first two picks, leading off their night by selecting Oregon State infielder Nick Madrigal with the fourth overall pick in the draft. Madrigal joins a crowded but extremely talented pool of young White Sox infielders in both the minor leagues and at the major league level. More from Da Windy City with the 46th overall pick in the second round, the White Sox selected Steel Walker, an outfielder from Oklahoma. Walker was arguably the top college hitter available by the time that the White Sox were on the clock, as the White Sox expanded their best player available approach past the first round and into the second round. Walker joins an even more crowded group of White Sox outfield prospects, but Walker's bat, unlike others in the White Sox farm system, projects to play anywhere. All in all, the White Sox went with two top-notch, flexible college bats with their first two picks. The White Sox added to their major league best farm system in the best way possible by adding two potential quick minor league risers. Use your arrows to browse.